Good evening, good morning or good afternoon folks. I'm just uh, at Colwyn Bay and I'm heading to Clan Dud now. So uh, come and join me folks. As usual, don't forget to like and subscribe. Absolutely fantastic day. One of the best days of the year weather I've known. It's absolutely gorgeous. So come and join me folks on my ride. I'll hopefully do one or two clips on the way. Otherwise, see it clandered now. Follow me, folks. Follow me. Tide's right in now, folks. Earlier videos, you'll see that slipway right to the end. So, yeah, I was going to get a few shots around here. Yeah, lovely view here. I'm now Ross on sea on my way. Hopefully, the plan is to go to. Uh, Clangoffin, not Clangoffin, Clan does no, Brian did. <laughs> anyway, it's a bit of a sea mist over there, but still a nice view. Follow me. Yeah, nice little fishing boat there. It's amazing the difference of view with the tide in. And apparently, the waters are really calm at the moment, they're not normally like this, so. Good time for photography and video. Ayo. Ayo. Folks, I've just had to cycle up quite a steep hill. The electric got me no problem. It says uh, in one mile now. It's landed now that way, I think. Follow me. Right, there's the grand hotel in Clan Dudden there and I've got to go down a steep hill now which I don't like going down so follow me yeah hi folks I'm just on the outskirts now of Clan Dudden uh, there was a nice ride in I said electric bike it got me up that hill no problem so uh, it's a bit hilly on the way back but i'm sure i'll be okay so uh, let's carry on folks follow me follow me yeah hi folks i'm a bit closer in now it's a lovely seafront uh lovely little ride in here and lovely views there's a nice uh bike there to finish off 650 triumph which is nice to see as well follow me folks follow me yeah just spotted the lifeboat station there so it's worth a shot i wonder where it was here uh, there it is hey oh hey oh lovely yeah a bit closer now to the lifeboat folks just for another clip that's off again to all the lifeboat people for all they do a wire in the way there that's my microphone wire yeah hats off again to the uh, folks they do a grand job and they all volunteers well done yeah that's where i've just sort of come along here folks it's been a lovely uh lovely little ride out absolutely loved it the weather is absolutely perfect follow me folks follow me yeah there's a lovely little pool for the kids there folks i'm uh, keeping a distance shot there there's a little park there and this is the main promenade down there so that's where I'm heading now down there folks so come and follow me follow me folks yeah hi folks I've got a bit uh, closer now there's the pier there and the great horn is at the back there and that hotel there again is the grand i've stayed there a few times um had some good nights there 
right into time and so on and uh, had some good memories going there over the years so uh, I haven't been there for a while sometimes it's down to price but uh, a lot of times I travel on my own and when you stay in a hotel they charge you the same price for one or two people so it gets a bit pricey and I'm just sat on the bench now there's my bike follow me yeah hi folks thanks for joining me one thing about having the saddle bag on the bike I've got some cans of pop in there I'm not uh, tight, I could have gone and spent three quid on a coke somewhere, but uh, I'd rather have my own stuff. Yeah, that's nice. It's been a nice ride in. Really enjoyed it. Um, it's definitely some place where I'll be coming again uh, next year and probably this year. So that location there is, is absolutely spot on. So I'm going to have a 40 minute break here now then have a little quick look round uh, the shops I think folks so come and join me I've got a pound shop actually uh, uh, not that I really need anything the trouble is with a pound shop you go in to buy one thing and you end up spending about 30 quid just for a bar of soap anyway that's another story follow me yeah hi folks I'm a bit closer to the town now it's surprising how long this seafront is uh, again you've got the Grand Hotel on the right and then uh, just gonna pan around there because all the hotels are over on that side the shops are sort of behind them so I'm gonna head straight down there now folks so follow me Right folks, this is the uh, war memorial there. I always get a shot wherever I go. I never to forget our heroes. Uh, so I've got a message as well. So it's quite busy around here folks. Just do a little pan round. There's certainly some people around over there at the pier. Follow uh, me. Yeah, have a quick shot of the Grand Hotel and uh, so there's a lot of people heading towards the pier so uh, yeah quite busy down here follow me yeah hi folks I'm just in the town centre now there's my bike it's double locked, so it should be pretty safe. Yeah, I'm going to start again, folks, because I I did get uh, the woman thought I was a parking attendant again, and even though I took the ivies off. Uh, right, so I'm in the uh, centre now. Uh, there is a chip shop just there. Oh, it's a cafe there. There is a chippy round here somewhere, which uh, it's not a bad one. So uh, just going round again, because what I was going to before going interrupted, there is a curry house. It's upstairs. It's not bad. Quite recommend that one if you come to Clan Lud. Yeah, Clan Lud. No, get it right. Follow me. It's, it's quite busy here. Uh, I'm not going to do too much filming in the town. It's the number twelve again to real. Uh, yeah, it's uh, certainly busy here. Uh, I see we've got peacocks here, which at least that's open here. I don't go in there very often, but it's not ideal for families to get their clothes. Follow me. This is Market Street down here, folks, and you've got the Weatherspoons. That's the back end to the Weatherspoons pub. Up there you can just see it. It's the Palladium here. I might be at the front end in a bit. Follow me. So you've got the Poundland over there folks oh there's the chip shop and i usually go in they're not bad over there uh, i think the last time we went in they didn't do many fish and chips so i had to go somewhere else but yeah it's certainly busy down here today folks 
the Pain Bakery there folks, that's worth a visit. Uh, pasties are quite nice in there, but I've had my uh, breakfast so earlier, so I'm not really eating anything at the moment. You've got a Greg's over there. Let's carry on walking down folks. Little shopping centre here, it's not that big. I know it's got the Vodafone shopping. I'm not going to go in there today, but it's quite busy. Got a few of the usual shops in there. Check it out if you come. I'm going to carry on down now. Uh, Marks and Spencer's over there. Let's carry on down, folks. Follow me. Nice church here, folks. Always like the brickwork on that. Yeah. A shot of the church there. Quite busy, busy down there, folks. Gonna head that way now. A bit of traffic in front of me. Follow me. Busy down here, folks. Uh, lots of uh, flowers for sale. I don't know if they're real ones, I don't think they are. But uh, that's another story, they look alright. Follow me. There, folks, uh, got the Welsh rock shop here. And another fish and chip shop. Um, which is supposed to be really good there as well, folks. Follow me. Yeah, well, I've stayed in that hotel in the past and when I came, this building here was derelict over there. Now it's been completely uh, rebuilt, it looks really nice. Doesn't look like it's open, but it's been rebuilt, it looks a nice place. Follow me. It's a few minutes walk from the town centre. You've got Primark, Superdrug, JD, River Island, Next, uh, New Look, Debenhams here. Uh, there is a, a Costa EE car phone where it is closed down. So check them out, folks, if you want to do a bit of shopping. Yeah, hi, folks. This is the uh, Palladium, it's a Weatherspoons. I'm hoping to go in here for a coffee, but there seems to be a queue at the moment, so just do a little pan round where I am. Uh, so, certainly some folks are around to die. Follow me, folks. Follow me. Yeah, hi, folks. Uh, I'll shortly be ending the video, I'm going to ride up to the other end of the seafront. This is the clock here, I always like this clock just there and there's some lovely flowers as well. There, it's really nice. Ay oh, ay oh. Yeah, hi folks, thanks for joining me on this tour of Clandud now. When I cycled in there was a car like double parked. I took the notice and the woman come across and she was on about a photo of me taking a photo. I thought she wanted me to take a picture in case she got a ticket because the people at the hotel said she could pull out there because she's asthmatic. And I didn't understand what she was on about. I said all that to her, well, do you want me to have, what do you want me to do? Do you want me to carry your bag? She goes, no. She said, uh, I don't want a parking ticket. I said, well, I'm not a parking attendant. So... Uh, that was the one thing and then I was stood by my bike, I hadn't even got my IVs on and a chap come over and said, uh, it's, he, he said, you're the parking attendant, I said no, he wanted to know the best way to get to Anglesey, so uh, yeah, it's amazing, but it's been nice round here, there is a lot of elderly folks, I mean I'm getting on a bit, but there is a lot of elderly folks and it does give you a wake up call, uh, the wall you have got your legs and your health to do as much as you can because uh, you know I've seen a lot of uh, 
elderly people all walking around enjoying themselves. That probably me one day because I say I'm getting on a bit, but what I've still got me uh, legs to get me around. I'm trying to make the most of life and I advise everyone else to do the same. I'm just going to swing around because there's a open top bus there going down. So I'm now going to cycle to the other end of the seafront and I'll probably end the video then folks. So come and join me to the other end. Follow me folks, follow me. So that's CJ there folks if you fancy a boat trip coming down to Clandud now and uh, looks like they're doing some nice trips there that's got video bomb by a seagull and another one follow me yeah that's where I'm heading now folks over the all the way along there back to Ross on sea it's been an absolute fantastic day and it's not over yet not over yet by a long shot I'm really enjoying it it's been fantastic follow me folks follow me hi folks I'm now at the other end of the seafront I'm going to head back to Ross on sea now so I'm going to end the video now as usual don't forget to like and subscribe give me the thumbs up folks and uh, hi to everybody it's been a lovely bike ride to Clan Ludno it did take long um, there is a bit of a hill to go up now uh, but I shouldn't have any problem on the bike got plenty of battery so uh, that's it for now folks so I think I've said don't forget to like and subscribe and hi to everybody wherever you are and I'll catch you on the next video folks bye for now bye folks